But first, Pittsburgh International Airport is commemorating Earth Day by showing off a trend that's growing around the country, on-site beehives. Mm -hmm. And Ross Gadotti, he suited up to take on the story. He tells us how it started and what it's become. If you have ever wondered what it's like to hold a bunch of bees in your hand, well, I can tell you it's a pretty intimidating experience, all things considered. But also having said that, it is also quite remarkable. This frame, just one of hundreds here at Pittsburgh International Airport, where these little flyers have a place to rest and do what they need to do. With the roar of passenger jets overhead, on a small portion of the airport grounds, if you listen very closely, you can hear a distinct buzz. If you look at, at peak populations and the number of colonies that we have, you're about 4 million bees in total. Behind the beekeeper's jacket and head cover is Steve Rapaski, resident beekeeper, who along with Ben Scherzer, airport wildlife administrator, are the ones who oversee this bee farm, if you will. Why at the airport, though? Initially, it started off as just we were collecting bees um, due to the fact that we had them land on a, the wing of an aircraft. Um, it delayed the flight roughly two hours. Since then, the program's grown from a few beehives to... On the airport property, we have approximately 125 colonies. Uh, that will probably increase to about 150 to 175 during our peak uh, season. And what's that mean in individual bee amounts? How about 4 million? and a lot of honey as well. We could produce anywhere from 1,000 to 3,000 pounds of honey here at the airport. Which Rapaski then sells. He says honeybees are extremely docile and very important. 80% of the food that we eat is pollinated by honeybees in some fashion. Uh, so that means one out of every three bites of food can be attributed to pollination. But the world isn't exactly doing good things for bees. Honeybees in general uh, are experiencing losses year to year, upwards of 40% in Pennsylvania. Parasites, pesticides, poor nutrition and pathogens are all to blame, but the airport authority says these bees are flying the friendly skies around here. We have a lack of pesticide use. We have an abundance of, of great resources in terms of forage. If you happen to find a beehive migrating or you don't want to quite where you're at, check out kdk.com. We have links and numbers for you to make sure if you see any of these flying around your house, they get where they need to go. At Pittsburgh International Airport, Ross Gadotti, KDK TV News.